Welcome back to another video. Today we have the Flex 24 Blasters tools. Don't forget to help out the channel by subscribing, hitting the like, hitting the bell icon so we can buy more tools like this. Make more to review videos. That's the way YouTube runs the platform by subscribers and likes. Just, uh, I just wanted to point this out. I did buy these with my own money. I did purchase these online. So no one is paying me for this. And I'm not, these, these tools have not been sent to me for free. Um, this video is going to be a series, a little series of the flex. Uh, we're going to be doing an unboxing video today. We're going to be presenting the tools, what we're going to be getting. And we're going to give some opinions of what I feel about these, my first impressions. And I'm going to tell you guys a little bit more about the launch of this. Uh, this what do I think about this, the, the launch and everything, all the tests they did. Um and then in the future we will be putting these against milwaukee and dewalt tools so top of the line milwaukee and top of the line dewalt these are top of the line tools so they should perform as like top of the line dewalt and top of the line milwaukee's so um we're gonna see the real the real tests um see the real thing in the real world all right let's go ahead and start with the unboxing here we have hammer drill says with turbo mode and quick eject impact driver kit. So this is uh, this is supposed to be top of the line uh, FXM 202 2B, and then we got 0330301001. It says uh, flex 24 volts power tools, two tools, two batteries, one charger. It says 20% more power, and we're gonna see that. If that's true, see flexpowertools.com for details. It says 25% longer runtime and it says 50% uh, faster charging. You get a five year warranty. It says tools, batteries, and chargers. Um, according to Flex, they're going to give a lifetime guarantee to the first year for whoever purchases their their tools they're gonna give a lifetime guarantee on these and obviously if these tools aren't good or if they're not good I'll let you guys know that way you don't have to go spend your money that's the side view of the box pretty much the same thing so we got the flex advantage 20% more outperforms average 18% more platforms well according to flex they do have uh, uh, more batteries says here up to 50% faster charging charges half time standard 75 watt charge we got sensor or intelligent battery processor overload protection temperature control for higher power heavy use this is thermo thermotech heat management innovative cooling system minimizes heat for 25 percent longer runtime and then we're going to see that too i do have a thermometer so we can test the tools see if they run hot or not drop resistant design engineer with a shock resistant design and sealed electronics i right, got five-year warranty we got specifications here we got no load speed zero to 550 um, and then we got 0 to 2000 RPM. It says turbo speed. 0 to 700. Maybe that's on the first and the second. The second one is uh, 0 to 2500 RPM. It says impact rate. 0 to 8800 to 0 to 3200 RPM. We got turbo impact rate. 0 to 11, 11,200. 0 to 40,000 RPM impacts per minute. We got max torque, uh, 1,400 pounds, 158 newton meters, clutch settings, 24 dh, chuck capacity, uh, half an inch, half an inch PO, says chuck type, metal single sleeve keyless ratchet with uh, carbide teeth, says tool length, 7.2 inches, 1.182 millimeters, tool weight, 3.8 pounds, 1.7 kilo. Accessories included. It says side handle, bit holder, belt clip. And then we got Spanish here and some other language. All right, we got quarter of an inch eject hex impact driver. Um, so it does have that quick eject um, feature on this. It says no load speed, um, zero to 1900. And then we got 2700 and then we got 4000 RPM. 
Impact rates, we got 0 to 4,450 IPM. Impacts per minute, we got max torque, 2,500 uh, inch pounds, 282 newton meters. So we got collet, quick eject, half well, a quarter of an inch PO hex, uh, quick eject, half a uh, quarter of an inch hex, I guess. Tool length, uh, four four inches, four point seven inches, uh, one nineteen millimeters. It says tool weight, two point seven pounds, one point two kilograms. That's for the impact, by the way. Got accessories included. Uh, we got a belt holder, a belt clip, a number two Phillips bit, a T twenty five bit, and I guess that's it. And let's see the bottom. All right, here's the the tools, the two tools, the the bag, and the charger. We got obviously we got a five amp hour battery and a two and a half. Um, we got flex. What's in the box? I says, yeah, we already went over this, I guess. We'll just go over it. Half an inch two speed hammer drill with dry, uh, turbo mode. Uh, a quarter of an inch hex impact or quick eject hex impact driver with multi multi mode. 2.5 lithium uh, ion battery, 5.0 lithium uh, battery, 160 watt fast charger, accessories listed, tool specifications, flex bag, Sh Shervon North America. Um, it says made in China. All right, that's what comes in the box. So all right, the first thing out of the box, you got a nice bag. Like I said, this is just an unboxing video. I will have test these tools one by one. I will make a separate video for each tool. And I will be making a separate video for the charger and for those batteries. So that's that's a separate video. But this is just an unboxing. I will have try to have those videos out by either today or tomorrow. At the longest, three days, depending how busy I'm at work. Anyways, um, this is a nice... Yeah, this actually feels pretty heavy duty stuff. Got a zipper here. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Pretty heavy duty. We got some nice handles. And then this should be another bag. Yep, this is another bag here. Bag there feels pretty pretty rugged, pretty high quality here. So it says 24 brushless does have some sort of uh, support here from the bottom so the next thing out of the box we got some bits here all right so there we go we got some flex they're green t25 they look okay quality we're gonna see how well these perform it says flex ph2 now we got an instruction manual here i'm just going to show you guys what comes in it I'm not going to read the whole thing. All right, we got a nice sticker here for the truck. We got a sticker there. We got a thank you. Uh, register your tools, I guess, guess for the warranty. Uh, we got a manual for the batteries. We got another manual here for the charger. We got a manual here for the impact driver. We got a manual here for the, I guess for the maybe for the uh, hammer drill and the drill driver regular. So same manual for both. All right, the next thing out of the box, uh, I think it's the battery. It's uh, it's the five amp hour battery. But um, pretty beefy compared to other brands. Um, it does have some rubber stops here on the side, so you can lay that on the side. Um, so it's actually thicker. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if these are 21700 cells. Uh, it does have a button here. It tells you the, 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 the battery gauge on the side, on both sides. As you guys see, and the buttons here on the front. And then we got the green here, flex 5 amp hour battery, 24 volts. All this black part is rubber. All right, we're gonna weigh the battery here, the five amp hour battery. Two pounds, 2.4 ounces. And this is the the clip here, so you guys could release the... It does have one, two, three, four connectors. 
uh, we do have a negative, positive, and then we got a D and a C. I don't know exactly what those mean, but I probably that's communication with the tool. It says F FX0121 lithium battery pack, 24 volt, 5 amp hour battery, 120 watt hours. Made in China, Sherva, North America. Here's the other one. Here's the other one here. It's a two and a half amp hour battery. Same thing. 5.8 ounces. Got the impact driver. All right, we got a three speed modes, uh, quick eject collet, self tapping screw modes. Uh, it says core wrench hex impact driver with multi mode. That's a BL brushless motor flex. You got some nice rubber grip. All this black part is rubber. It does have some nice rubber stops. And you do got some nice ventilation here. Some nice vents. This is uh, metal. This is rubber. This is our collet. It's a little weird because it's obviously they got another design. Um, but it's, it's it feels a little weird, but it, it works pretty good. You can still grab it, no problem. It does have that quick in, uh, re eject, so you guys see there the quick eject button. You got a nice trigger, pretty smooth, and then we got a nice yeah, it's pretty smooth, it's not too bad. Um, let's see what else. Like I said, it does have some ru uh, rubber stops, you can lay this down. Talking about the handle, feels feels not too bad. It feels pretty good. There's one, two, and three. It does have some rubber. I do like this. This is one thing I like about this tool. It does have rubber buttons instead of those plasticky ones that uh, break and fade away. This is rubber, so I like really like that. And then this is the maybe for the screws, the T mode. Maybe a speed for the screws. Then you got the light, that's the LED light. Um, you got 24 volt max. You can put uh, a belt clip. I'm pretty sure it's included in here. Um, you got, f actually, I thought it was four connectors, but you got uh, five connectors there. So, um, five connectors. It says use only flex 24 volt series batteries. Serial number made in China. Uh, we got FX1371A. Okay, we got two pounds. 10.9 ounces. All right, we're gonna put a two and a half amp hour battery. Pretty smooth. So that's speed one, obviously. Speed two, speed three. It starts, it seems like it has a soft start and then it ramps up. And we got some nice ventilation here. That's really this one thing I like about these tools. Really nice ventilation here. It's gonna it'll, it'll keep the tool cool. Four pounds, uh, zero point seven ounces. A little hard to get off, but you know obviously the tool is brand new. So, all right, here's that. All right, with the five amp hour battery, we, what is this? Four and thirteen ounces. Thirteen point four ounces. A nice LED here, really bright LED. It's a true white LED, it's not the blue ones. All right, let's take this off. And one thing I like about this, if you don't want to put the belt clip, you can stand it up without having the belt clip in there. We got the charger, it says flex, fast charger, 160 watt. Um, it says FX0411 charger. It says Sherva North America, made in China. We do got some uh, indentations here, so you guys could hang it up on your garage or something. We got three inches, so it tells you the measurements. All right, we got it looks like the drill, the hammer drill. It does say turbo mode uh, on revealed torque anti-kickback all right we got um hammer drill obviously this is uh, one of the better ones that they have hammer drill we got build brushless motor we got uh since 23 uh clutches 
Yeah, 23 um, goes all the way up to, yeah, 23 um, different settings or clutches. We got a uh, hammer drill, we got a screw mode, and we got a regular drill mode. Uh, let's see here, we got, like I said, nice rubber stops here on the sides. So it lays down pretty pretty good, pretty okay. Um, we got nice rubber, all the black part is rubber. We got flex there, plastic. We got a nice chuck here, what is this, a Jacobs? It is a Jacobs chuck, so you know you're getting a good quality chuck here. It is metal, everything is metal here on the chuck pretty smooth we got one and two speeds brushless motor we got FX 120 127 127 1T um, hammer drill says use it hand side handle twist out of the control always use the side handle this one the same thing it does have five connectors you have a turbo mode now this is the famous turbo mode button here. Let's put a battery in here, see what this, uh, I'm gonna put the smaller battery here. That's second speed. First speed. Second speed and turbo mode. I guess turbo mode was on already. So I guess it's a three-speed drill. You can call a three call this a three-speed uh, drill, basically. That's it. You got a nice light at the bottom. Uh, we got some belt clips here for the tools. I'm gonna go ahead and put these on. Here's another one. And then we got uh, a handle for the for this. All right, we got a nice handle. Oh yeah, this is really nice. This feels really good quality. This is all rubber. Yeah, this is all rubber, so it feels really nice. You got some plastic inside, metal here, metal here. And then I guess, yeah, you can pretty much twist this. We got some, obviously you got some grease there. All right, the drill by itself says three, three pounds, 11.8 ounces. The two with the two and a half, it's five pounds, 1.6 ounces. The two with the five, it's five pounds, 14.4 .4 ounces. So you can put the handle there. Actually, you got some nice uh, metal contacts there. So you can put this in the indentations. So you can put the handle there. That's uh, really nice. So you get a lot of grip. Let me just put this. So you guys see there, it's 4.4 pounds, 8.3 ounces. All right, guys, so what do I think so far of this kit? Um, well, I think these are, they seem to be pretty good quality tools um, from what I noticed in the cosmetics. They feel pretty f professional grade. Um, I, haven't, I haven't tried these myself, so it's too early to tell. Like I said, I will be making videos later on today or tomorrow. Um, I'll probably just start with the drill or well, I'll start with one of these and then make another for the for the charger. I'll see that in the battery. See how long they 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 last or they take. Um, what do I think about the launch and the presentation? Well, you know what? Pretty much just like any other uh, brand, I guess they they exaggerated a little bit. Um, I think um, they could have done a little better by putting. Uh, Top of the line tools out there um, I know they had a Milwaukee drill um, but they didn't have the, the HO batteries they just had the regular 5 amp hour battery on that thing and there's other like the this like the, the the Milwaukee impact driver I know that one's a really like it's it's a beast so we'll see what happens I know they did like I said they, they did exaggerate a little bit and I don't feel that they they sh they should have just put the 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 HO top of the line uh, batteries with those tools and the salsa they should have 
you know what? I know they they're trying to push their their their, their brand out, and any 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 brand, if you guys been following the tool business, any brand will do that. Even Milwaukee and you want to do that. Um, they exaggerate a little bit, you know, they put a little bit lower tool so that way the tool looks good. That's just the way it works, you know, in marketing business and whatnot. Um, I will be letting you guys know how I feel about these tools and we'll do live reviews about these. See if they're worth it, see if they're not, you know, if it's worth it for you to move into this line or not. I would say for now that I just uh, unboxed this. I think if if you're on the need for for a drill and impact driver, obviously with the good warranty, because then right now they're offering a uh, well, lifetime good warranty with these. You can register your tools, and you're gonna get. There's nowhere else you're gonna get a better warranty right now with any other brands. But if you're already uh, into another line, I would definitely think about it because you already invested. You already have a lot of batteries. But if you don't care, you know, obviously. These are great tools. Well, so far they're great. We'll see if they're not. Anyways, this is just my opinion. Um, until now, we'll see what happens. We'll make more videos. Don't forget to help out the channel by subscribing, hitting the like, hitting the bell icon. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching.